to the ice skating rink, Alpine Ice. Um, I haven't been there in oh, 20 years, not since I was a teenager, something like that. When was the last time you were at an ice skating rink? Uh, 20 years ago. 20 years ago, yeah. It's pretty inexpensive, it's like 15 bucks uh, each to get in. So, uh, yeah. I got the GoPro, I got the chest harness, I got a wrist harness. Um, so I should get some interesting video today. Interesting video is right. In fact, probably the most interesting video would be this time-lapse photography here. This is taking uh, two frames a second. And uh, yeah, time-lapse photography. <laughs> So I've got this GoPro camera now, as you know, I haven't had it for long. And I'm looking for things to do with it, content to create. And I had this fantastic idea in my head, you know, we've got an ice skating rink nearby, Alpine Ice down Brougham Street. And I haven't been there for about 20 years, and I'm not exaggerating, I haven't been there for about 20 years. <laughs> They had the genius idea to go take the GoPro to the ice skating rink. And I looked on the other YouTube videos and I looked at how fantastic and beautiful the footage looked and all that stuff. And then I get to the ice skating rink and immediately alarm bells went off in my head because the place was so friggin' dark. They made it like a nightclub. They turned off all the white lights, all of the main lights and had all these multicolored blue and red and yellow and green lights just flashing around the place. They're trying to make it look like a nightclub, honestly. And this is during the public skating session, Saturday and Sunday afternoons, 2 to 4 p.m. <laughs> and, yeah, as you can see from the footage, I've had to apply brightness to this video. So to be honest, this whole video is an epic fail in terms of GoPro footage. Uh, probably the, the interesting part is this video you're seeing right here of um, actually putting the uh, GoPro camera on the ice skates. And you get a little bit of ice skate footage like that. I suppose that's about the most interesting thing. The other big problem was getting bloody skates that fit. So I first tried on a 9. 9's too small. Then tried on a 10. 10's too small as well. Well 10 is long enough. But, I, I don't know, you guys will have to help me out here, leave a comment if this, if, if you, if this has happened to you as well. The skates are so friggin' narrow. Maybe it's that I'm fat, and maybe because I'm fat I have wider feet. I have fairly wide feet. And you put the skates on, and they bloody, they just cramp, cramp up your feet. And it's so bloody painful. And that's what I'm saying in this little video segment here with Coco. My feet are in such agony. So bloody painful. And I don't know if it's necessarily the ice skates. Because I remember having this same problem when I was a teenager with rollerblades. Has anybody else had this same problem? Because I basically, we didn't actually ice skate on this ice skating rink for any longer than about half an hour. We both did about half an hour and that was it. Um, I just couldn't bear anymore. Coco doesn't mind if, if we're there for five minutes or half an hour. Doesn't really bother her too much. <sighs> so yeah, this whole video is a big flop. And if you've made it to this this second half of the video, I commend you and I, I clap my hands to you for watching it. <laughs> uh, the only other interesting thing is um, going around in a public ice skating session like this, you see kid after kid after kid fall flat and fall over and fall over another one falls over it's actually quite funny i had to stop myself laughing probably the only reason i didn't laugh is because i'm trying to concentrate on what i'm doing too because i haven't ice skated in about 20 years and i used to feel pretty damn confident on the ice and now after 20 odd years that confidence is all gone to shit it's completely gone so you can see at the end here we were happy to get our skates off we were happy to get the hell out of there <laughs> When's the next time we will go ice skating? I don't know. They've got, they've got ice skating at Tekapo, but I don't know. 
Anyway, if you like travel videos or adventure videos, uh, click that like button and subscribe, even though this video is a piece of shit. I do have better videos than this one, though.